We're here to make some history this weekend. Who's up for it here? Say I. I know we have people here from 138 countries, almost 23,000. And I know some of you are up at 3 in the morning, some it's midnight, some of you it's already tomorrow. I've been preparing for two and a half months to do something that's never been done before. You know, we have 16 foot high ceilings here to give you a perspective, 50 feet wide, 180 degrees around me and in the back again, so I could see you all and interact with you all in this time period. And so we're going to use these tools to change our lives from where you are. Who's here ready to do this and get everything you possibly can out of the weekend here? Say I! Life is the dance between what you desire most and what you fear most. A leader is someone who lives life on their terms. Someone who won't settle for less than they can do or be or share or create. We're going to be the creator of our future. We're going to decide what we're going to do with whatever life has given us and we're going to make the shifts necessary to make that happen. Momentum is the difference between success and failure. When you move, you create emotion, energy in motion. These emotions that are in you are habits. And if we're gonna change our lives, we gotta change the habit of those emotions, which means the way we use our physical body. But what really changes your body, your emotion, is a shift in identity, which means doing something different than you expect. Put yourself in that state where it's like, I'm gonna get in shape, I'm gonna rip it open. There you go. That, look at those muscles. Give her a hand, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up for her. There we go. Yeah. I've got this. I've got this. What we want to do over the next few days in creating new momentum is be able to figure out how do we create this emotional mastery that gives you joy no matter what happens. Because the quality of your life is where you live emotionally. It's how do you do when all hell's breaking loose and nothing's going your way? How do you do when things are unjust? How you deal with those things shape your character and your destiny more than anything else. If you can take your worst experience and make it your best, then life is always a gift. And that's what this weekend's about. It's about taking the things that have happened to us and realizing they're happening for us. Life is too short to suffer. So why not live in a beautiful state? If you want the happiest, most joyous, most beautiful life, trade your expectations for appreciation and your whole life will change in that moment. Meaning equals emotion and emotion equals life. You have a recipe inside of you. This event isn't about you changing or becoming something, it's about unleashing, tapping into what already exists inside of you. There's a beautiful energy when you are around people that want to be better too. Right now, we are in an opportunity of a lifetime. 138 countries, 23,000 people who are here to be better. This is massive action, isn't it? You taking action constantly, even when you don't feel like it. You guys are awesome because I can see all of you. Raise your hand if you came here because you want to make a difference in your life and the lives of people that are around you. Say aye. So it's not like life always goes your way. You live in a beautiful state because you know whatever life gives you, you find a way to use it. And we all need to do that during these times of our reactions to COVID and the impacts to COVID more than COVID itself. And also the things that are happening in various countries, especially the United States around race. All these issues have to be dealt with, but they need to be dealt with from a beautiful place. But to do that, you gotta train yourself. Emotional fitness, that's where freedom comes. That's where joy comes. That's where love comes from. feeling is in you, as you, because this is the real you. This is the you without the fear. This is the you without anxiety, without frustration, without stress. This is what your spirit is made of. This is what your soul is made of. Joy, love, gratitude. This is you remembering that life is a gift. Every breath is a gift. There are no guarantees. But this beautiful heart of yours is beating. As long as it beats, you have the opportunity to enjoy this life. Let's not waste it. Not for a moment. This is you unleashed.